How y'all doing out there? I'm back. I told y'all I was coming back. Y'all brought me back. So uh, what we got? How y'all doing? I hope everybody out there doing good, man. I hope everybody been safe out here in COVID. Hey, we back. The blacklist. This is what we've been wanting, right? What we've been asking for, we got it. Was it everything that you thought it was going to be or was it different? I'm going to give you my thoughts and I'm going to tell you right now. It was different. I didn't... Uh, I didn't expect Dembe to be an FBI agent. So basically, a lot of the roles from how the show started, it seemed like the writers, to me, just my humble opinion, I could be wrong, but it seemed like the writers are going in a different direction. Let me explain. Uh, I think it's going to be a unique season. It looked like uh, Dembe, I could be wrong, but it was like Dembe took Liz's role. And it's like Hurl took Redditon role. Now, this just me just this is me just guessing and just throwing out there some things. But just if I just sat back and I thought about it, and it's like, who 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 would have thought Dembe the FBI agent? I didn't think that at all. And I know didn't nobody else think that. But it, it was unique, though. And it was... I felt that... I don't know, man. It was just... Uh, it was just a different feel, I guess. I guess. I don't know. I, I don't know what other way to put it, you know? Like, if if we was to... If we was to... Uh, Look back at it. What do y'all think? Like, I mean, leave comments, man. Tell me what y'all think. Did y'all really think it was going to be this way? Did you really think that they were going to tap back into who Redditon is? My humble opinion, I don't think they tapping back into who Redditon is. Because right now, cause if you tap back into who Redditon is, you might as well bring back King. Because honestly, King was the only one really looking for the true identity. Now, Without King, why would you even chase down behind the identity? That means you'll put wrestler down behind a uh, down behind a ghost. You'll put um, uh, a Ram down behind a ghost. You'll put um, who else would be down behind a ghost? Pox would be down behind. You know the whole crew would be down behind a ghost. And you look at the crew; they really don't have the resources to go after nobody. So the to say. They gonna be the ones that look into who Redditon is. Like, where's the resources at? No one is really backed by the FBI. Now, if you really look at it, Redditon is the he the resource now. Like he he is he the FBI in season nine Redditon because he's bringing the he's bringing everything that he had and the F, and the former FBI agents are really coming with what the ones that's working with Dembe. If Dembe don't, you know, so I got to see how this joint play out, man. I, I really got to see how it play out because the way I'm looking at it, Dembe, it looked like to, to to me, just to me, the pecking order of where he at right now, he's nowhere near what Harold Cooper was last season. You know, he's he, he's not on that level. So how much control do he really have? So basically, from what I seen, Dembe. Is gonna be getting whatever, and they gonna be running down behind solving cases like that. I I don't know, but I thought it was a good episode. It, it felt good to see the game back together, and uh, I don't know. Then you got a Rom. He got some going on, but do y'all think they gonna get back on who Redditon is two years later? How they sped it up, and I, I just can't see them getting back to who Redditon is because. At this point in time, it'll be chasing down behind a ghost for real. Because who really have the resources like Liz had to go down behind to track this identity? Who is the imposter? Like, you, as you can see, wrestler don't have the resources. I mean, if anybody even close, it could be a wrong. Because he's still, you know, with the computer. Poxton got married. Can you believe that? So that's another twist. So I, I hope her husband... It's not the Tom King type. You never know. You know what I mean? So I, I just got to see how the writing is going with this season, man. Because like I said, to see Dembe as an FBI agent, that was Elizabeth King. To see 
Redditon, to see Harold Cooper. It's, it's just to see everybody roll to see how the show really go. Like I said, I thought it was a good episode. It, it really wasn't. I mean, what would we? It got to be. What would you searching for? What would you searching for? Me, I was just watching just to see how it was gonna be without King. What was, what would the narrative was gonna be? But like I say, I did get my one little, uh, my one little trick when I say when I seen Dembe as an FBI agent. Like I say, that was shocking. Now, now that was very very shocking. And basically, they spent the whole first season basically tying the gang back up together. It's basically like they did the... Uh, it, it, it's like history repeats itself. It, it's just like a recession. Even though this is the ninth year of the show, like, a recession happened every, what, 10 to 12 years down there? It, you know, it, you got the... It, it's like they starting over. It's like they starting from scratch but not from scratch to me. It's like they went back to the very first pilot, like the first pilot episode and say, okay, we just gonna switch everybody roles. That's how it looked to me. Now I could be wrong, but it just looked like, okay, we get, we gonna get Dembe Liz, Liz role, what Liz was to the show. Then, then we gonna get such and such this role. So everybody got a different role. Everybody's playing a different, they playing the same character. But and to me, it's like they playing different roles. Cause like I say, Dembe is picking up where Elizabeth left off at with this FBI thing. Whoever would have thought that though? All jokes aside, who would have thought Dembe would end up being an FBI agent? Pop out of the field. Aram has nothing to do with anything, and Russell just looked like, you know, <laughs> Russell looked like he been out there for the last past two years. So like I said, give me y'all thoughts, man. Leave comments. What do y'all think? I think. What I think, you know, like, I don't think they're going to come back and touch on the, uh, who is the imposter anymore. I, I really think those days are dead. Now, if y'all thinking they're going to come back to that, then, excuse me, it don't feel like that way from the first episode. It, it You know, it was like a little hint, but I don't really think they're going back that way. I think they're going to go on past Redditon Identity, who he really is, because I think they told us in the last season, who he really was. So, you know, to revisit that is like opening up old wounds. Do people still want to hear them say he's Katarina? Yes. But I just don't think they're going to get that satisfaction. They didn't sing the closer or Dave Chappelle. <laughs> uh, uh, you know, and, and, and I really think for real, uh, and I hate to say this, y'all, but I really think the way the world is right now, and that narrative, I just felt like it was cool before the weather of what you can do, what you can say, how people feel. Because you really don't know how, if it was going to be some serious backlash. You got to think how they thinking now. Was it going to be serious backlash to say, you know what? This is a woman portraying to be a man. How would that be? Like, how can you let that come out and in modern society, the way the world is today. Think about it. Because, I mean, look at what's going on. You know, you can't make no, you can really can't make a joke. I don't, I don't know. It, it's just, man, we, we just in a, we, we're in a different place in America, man. That's all I can really say. But let me get back to the blacklist. So that's why I feel like with the way of the, the way, the weather of the world, I think a lot of that got took in consideration, man. I could be wrong, but I, I don't think they wanted to, Ended on a transgender, and I, you know me, I get, let me, let me, let me, let me clarify what I'm saying. I'm not trying to offend anyone, but I just thought, I just think, you know, that's my opinion. Like they were just looking at everything, man, and they made a conscious decision to show it the way that they did. And like I say, that's just my humble opinion. I could be wrong, you know. So on that note, please leave comments. Tell me what did y'all think about season nine episode one and if you like the content man you know hit the like button subscribe to the channel this time i'm gonna stay true to my guns this is the first episode of season nine and i'm gonna see how far can i go i'm telling y'all man like i be working on my website oh yes my website is uh www.creditischest.com i will repeat that www.
creditischess.com. It's just information I got up there for people, trade lines, a lot of other things, you know. I just got, I just been, um, I've been busy, man, just, just really doing some things, man, just trying to help people for real. And uh, thank you, man, for checking out the video. And I hope you like what you hear. Subscribe to the channel. Not trying to take up too much of your time, but I already took up too much of your time. And on that note, I'm out. The Gov. Season 1, Episode 9. We winning, baby. Season 9, Episode 1. Look at me. Now I messed up. Just throw up the dubs. Ah. There ain't no West Coast. It's for winners right here, baby. It took me a while before I learned this, too. I ain't lying. Man. I used to do my fingers like this, y'all. <laughs> Just to get it right. <laughs> But now I got it. But anyway, y'all, get back to it, man. Uh, thank y'all, man, for checking out the video. And again, man, subscribe to the channel. It really don't hurt to press a button, man. You know what I mean? I'd do it for you. Do it for me. I'm out.